Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I want to finally film an update on my breastfeeding journey, where my son and I are at in it and how it's going for us. Um, it's not where I wish it was, but I but it's not going terribly. <laughs> so if you haven't watched my previous video on my breastfeeding story, I'll link it next to my head and also down below. I talk about um, basically the title is breastfeeding it doesn't come naturally to everybody and um, the instinct to breastfeed absolutely did come like come to me um, naturally like that's what I've always wanted to do with my kids that's what I've always assumed I would do the importance of it is huge to me um, and with my daughter I was heartbroken because I could not make enough for her and so in between that I still I nursed her till she was 14 months we just supplemented about half of what um, she needed maybe a little bit more than that um, but we were able to she was getting at least breast milk until 14 months and then after that I was kind of like okay I felt like it was because I had lost too much weight too quickly after I had her um, and then I just couldn't catch up but I came to find out right before my son was born I actually have something called IGT where I don't have enough um, essentially enough storage in my breasts and it doesn't matter on the size what it is is it's like the tissue that holds milk in your breasts it, I just don't have enough of it my body is doesn't so um, I, I essentially can't store it and every succeeding pregnancy and nursing you have more of that storage so you can make more however I um, as I found out I still don't make enough for my son um, we're only supplementing about eight ounces a day which is huge praise like God is good and it's amazing that he's only needing eight ounces a day not from me um, I wish it was none however that's just not where I'm at and um, so we use this something called an SNS every time we nurse where it's a little bottle and it has a tube that goes right next to my nipple and he's getting milk from that and me as well and um, Thankfully, again, thank the Lord, I've been able to get breast milk from other mamas this whole time. So he is now four months old and he's still been exclusively breastfed. He's only been on breast milk, which is a huge praise and a huge desire of mine. My goal was to reach three months and then kind of like not worry about it as much. But I still prefer breast milk for my son. Um, just knowing the types of ingredients they put in formulas, I just I want to stay away as much as possible. Um, I'm okay. My daughter was on, you know, formula quite a bit, and that's okay. Uh, she's perfectly healthy and fine, so it wasn't going to be the end of the world for me, but I, it breaks my heart. Um, so I do take quite a few supplements every day. I take euphoric, or not euphoric, yeah, euphoric herbal supplements. Um, I take, it's um, Dairy Diva, and I take double the recommended amount. So I take six six of her Dairy Diva pills every or three times a day which is usually the highest recommended dose is three and then I also do three uh, moringas and then I also do goat's through. Um, so that's kind of where we're at. Um, my feelings about it is I'm honestly I'm hurt. Uh, you know it's the deepest desire of my heart to be able to nurse my babies and feed them and it hurts that it feels like God doesn't really care to be honest I'm not like I, there's nothing wrong with me wanting to nurse my babies why will you not help me with this is kind of what it feels like so um, I guess I'm more just like confused and a little bit hurt by that um, but God is still good and he has he maybe he doesn't have a reason maybe he doesn't have a reason why other than the fact that we're in a broken world and my body's not perfect nothing in this world is perfect anymore because um so that's kind of where I'm feeling on that I'm happy that we're only at eight ounces a day that's great um there's something else I was going to say about that though as well oh um I guess I'm it's kind of hard to accept this time having to supplement because I know it's my body rather than just like I started off wrong before I just thought I was started off wrong on breastfeeding and couldn't catch up but now I know it's just that's how it is for me and it's just kind of hard to take and I fully expect to whenever we have a next one that's what I'm gonna have to do again and it's 
it makes me a little bit more emotional, I think, than this time around. And I'm okay with it. And I, I'm so grateful to have the SNS and then I can use that. And for the mamas that have donated to me and that I've been able to do that. Um, and that I, I'm so grateful that I don't work, that I stay at home. Because if I worked, there would be no way. And I'm also grateful for my husband, who's so understanding. We have a very tight budget, especially right now. And he has made it very clear that spend what I like, not spend whatever I need to, but you know, it's okay to spend the money on the supplements you need in order to breastfeed because he knows the importance, of it, like the health benefits of it and the importance of it to me personally as a, as a stay at home mom. So that's kind of where we're at with breastfeeding. I wish I had more of good news for you guys, but. I guess that's just the way the cookie crumbles for me right now. Um, like I said, God is good, even though I don't understand why he won't, it feels like he won't, you know, throw me a bone here or help me out here, but, um, he's still good and he is still, he's God, you know, I don't deserve anything from him. Um, I just don't and I know that, so, but it's still... Yeah, it's still just a little bit hard to take, I guess. So, anyways, guys, um, thank you so much for watching. I don't know, um, I guess I don't know how to end it. <laughs> That's, like I said, where we're at. He's a healthy little boy. He's doing great. And I'm, like I, I said, I'm really glad we're at where we're at. But I wish we could do it better. But that's okay. So, anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.